Yo, what's happening everyone? It's your boy here, Abdurrahim, back again with another great, amazing tech video. Well, the video of today, it's all about the flexible tripod. I know some of you guys check out my last video about this guy here. You, I hope some of you guys remember this guy. He helped us a lot, creating a lot of contents on our YouTube channel. And it did something which is so great and tremendous. But there are things which are ups and downs, which I can't recommend you guys to buy this kind of stuff. Since it has a great side of it and a downside of it. So you just have to be very careful. Another kind of flexible tripod. Now I got these two of them, but lastly, I thought that why not grab another one? This bad boy here, this is a flexible tripod. Now we got three families in the house but one family it's a little bit half dead uh, let us just like i was saying guys about this kind of family it's not that much great since some of the rubbers whenever you get water just know that this type of thing will happen the rubber will just get removed and it will just do like this way i hope some of you guys see the rubber looks like it has been eaten by a mouse or a rat or you know that kind of stuff so it's so so not that much worth it but when it comes to its own flexibility you might not find it interesting because it's it just flexes this way and this way and sometimes this is what happens some of you guys got that kind of clue so this is just like not that much worth it i don't recommend you guys to get this octopus tripod it's called octopus because of how it looks like yeah, this is so decent. First of all, what I like about it compared to the Octopus is just that you can adjust this. After adjusting it, you can see this it flexes in each kind of position. Now, it might be flexing this side, it might be flexing this side, flexing this side. You can see that it's so much worth it compared to the Octopus, which does not give it to you this, but you can just buy this one separately, which is what i like about it so you can just remove this header and you can just toss another um another tripod if you have it and it gives you those kind of precision so i think this is so important and it's quite worth it now let us just unbox the one the third one which came and i think it's so interesting to get the third one since it has some additional stuff I guess so so yeah so i'll be testing with you guys this kind of tripod on my video some of the videos if you didn't check them out i use this tripod click this link here up and it will take you definitely to that video you can see how the smoothness is compared to the other one but it doesn't give you that much stabilization it depends on you how much you're getting your image or video so let us just unbox this bad boy first of all you get a gift of this phone handler so you may toss your phone here with the tripod if you're a phone vlogger or you are a youtuber who uses a smartphone to record your videos so as how this one looks like it's First of all, there are things which I have to discuss about this bad boy too. So, this is our bad boy here. I like this color combination since red and black sounds great. So, another kind of stuff we get on the box is just that we're getting this type of stuffs are like this way. These are clippers, clippers for GoPro. If you're having a GoPro, you can use it. As you can see, this one, this smaller lock, I hope some of you can see it. This smaller lock, it was used to lock here. At the moment I got the uh, the tripod when I went to pick it up, so I, I I saw this kind of stuff. So this one got removed, it's a lock. So what I did, it was removing this clip here. As you can see guys, this white one, it removes its own self. Then you can just remove it, toss the camera back, remove it, toss the camera back. This is its lock. So it removed its own self and I was trying fixing it. And I thought that why am I just putting a lot of time and pressure on it? Why not me put the super glue? Now I just glued it here just like that simple and it's not removed. And I thought that, yeah, that's a problem solver. <laughs> why not? So yeah, I think this is so much important compared to the uh octopus but this is the most good bad boy compared to this one you can see the difference here this is a little bit longer this is stronger this is a little bit regular so I, in the scale of 10 to 0 this one i give it 4 this one i give it 8 because it's great <laughs> you already know this is called flexing you can see it flexes just like this bad boy here there is no difference here so yeah this is how these tripods look like and i hope some of you guys got that clue and concept how they look like 
and yeah that's what's up so thank you guys for watching i love this video today make sure you hit the thumbs up and i recommend you guys to get a good and a steady tripod handler which you can use it on your videos vlogs and whatever you gotta use it on your kind of ecosystem it might be so great so hit the thumbs up if you love this video today subscribe if you're new here my name is abdurrahim12 and i'll be catching you guys on the next one as always stay creative and peace Thank you.